Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider Preview build for the dev channel, which is 22K499. I've just installed it on my laptop and this is the version in the Winverse section, the latest Windows 11 Insider Preview build for the dev channel. In this video, we're gonna talk about what is new, what has changed, and also about a few fixes that I find important in this new build. Before starting the video, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel to be up to date when we post videos like this. Now let's begin with the changes. The biggest change in this new build is again something related to the Microsoft Teams app. Basically now during a Microsoft Teams meeting you can quickly share an open app from your Windows operating system by simply hovering over a certain app and then using the dedicated button that will be shown under the app thumbnail. You're gonna see a screenshot on the screen of how that button looks and again, that feature is still not implemented to all the Windows Insider users, only to a small part of them. So I don't have it in this build, but you're gonna be able to see that in the screenshot. And now basically when you're done sharing your content, you can simply hover over the window again and then click on stop sharing, or you can choose another window and then click on share this window. For more information about this feature, you can always check the Microsoft blog using the links down below in the article from the description. Another important thing to note is that the ISOs are again available for this build, 22K499, and you can download the ISOs using the links that will be in the article down below in the description. Another change is related to the Clock app. The app now supports signing in with a Microsoft Work or School account. And for this, you're gonna need the version 11.2110 or higher. This can basically help you more using the focus section feature. And also this will help you be more focused and more productive. In the feedback hub and the achievement section, Microsoft started rolling out the shipped Windows 11 badge to Windows Insiders. This is a very small thing, but we always love these new badges that Microsoft rolls out to us in the feedback hub. Microsoft also changed the keyboard focus visuals in task view and alt plus tab to be a little more prominent so they are easier to see. And as you can see here, when you switch between apps, the keyboard focus is a little bit more prominent. The margin is a little bit thicker so you can see better which screen you are selecting or which screen you are on at the moment. And this also will happen in the task view menu. Now regarding some fixes to this new build, the clipboard history should be back up and running properly once you are on this build. Now clicking a certain GIF in the emoji panel will now actually insert them into supporting apps unlike in the previous build. Regarding windowing, Microsoft made another fix to address an issue where the explore.exe would crash if you pressed Alt plus F4 while Alt tab was open. And regarding the settings app, Microsoft fixed a crash that could happen when trying to check remote sound properties while accessing a PC over remote desktop. So basically this is all we have in this new build. This is a smaller build with not a lot of new features or interesting features. I'm really hoping that Microsoft will soon start working on, on more interesting features, not on the Microsoft Teams app for example, because personally I don't use it so I don't find it really interesting when they add updates to it, but I'm sure that Microsoft will do it. Don't forget to check out the article down below in the description for the whole list of fixes and also the list of known issues in this build so you know what to expect if you install it. Of course, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the Tech Base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from Tech Base. Until next time, have a nice day.